The low vibrity can afford no better turn than this. Thou art a villain. I see thou knowest me not. Fine! This is not excuse the injury that thou hast done me! Turn and draw! Draw! You gonna run? Don't think I can't see it the way you got it all set up. Come on, give me some credit, eh? Renee's gone out on a limb for you, and this is how you're gonna repay him. You run, they lose their house. <laughs> Do the time. Some extra for Molly, yes? Thank you. Absolutely, Chef. Bon appetito. This deal you got with Tony, you resigned. Both of you. That's how he wants it. Don't ask us where he is, because we won't tell you. Daz, Fab, get out of here. Stay where you are, boys. I'm sorry, did you speak? You talked to Tony. Yeah, he told us where you were. He's a little bit angry about you avoiding us. Yeah. Tell me to tell you that. What? Jackie! Let me go! Tell me what happened! Just let me go! On my way down there, I found the car. It was at McPherson Street. It was halfway out the gutter. The doors were open. I checked it out for some damage, but it was fine, you know? Didn't seem to be anything wrong with it. But I didn't check under the front of the car, though. Where are you going? We're stuck here in the middle of nowhere, Hedley. <laughs> Maybe you are not. <laughs> hey, uh, perhaps you're referring to uh, your car, which you parked very dangerously to the cliff edge. If I win, I want just one thing. What's that, Ed? Grey. What? What do you mean you want grey? Well, you get your 20k. I want grey and everything that comes with such a privilege. Just what are you accusing me of? Terminal ego problems. You were prepared to see Edwina go through agonies of guilt rather than admit there was a much stronger probable cause for Stan's heart stopping. I want you to come to court with me. I made sure she had a hat on when she went outside. I did the sunscreen thing. I cooked every night, no takeaways. I don't understand what I did wrong. Well, we don't have to do anything wrong for our kids to get sick. It's just a fact of life. Well, what's the use of being a parent if you can't protect your child? All morning I've had this feeling, this pure love, this desire to be with you, Mel. I can't explain it. All I know is I want you with me. I mean, it's the only thing that seems right, you know? Who's garnishing? Me, Chef. Really? I just saw my skeleton's Barbie Harry. That wasn't a garnishing, it was a bloody shrubber. Come here, you bloody moron. <laughs> yes. See this? This is a knife, OK? Lemon verbena, finely chopped with citrus and crushed pistachios. How many times have you done this? Five! You had 